Cancer. What's up? Welcome to your love reading. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. It is the general reading, so this may or may not resonate with every Cancer watching this video. If you do need a personal reading, all that information is going to be down in the description box below. Uh, your current situation with the Three of Cups here, okay? So it looks like there is a potential of a reconciliation right now, okay? If this is not a reunion, it does look like um, you're chilling, you're having fun, you know, you're okay. One of you is, okay? One of you is just partying. Uh, focusing on their happiness and just doing what makes them happy okay that's the overall situation here three of cups on your mind is the death here so you could have ended things with this person out here okay whilst this person on their mind they're emotionally absolutely shut off okay they're not wanting to be emotionally vulnerable towards you um for the charity in reverse here you probably wanted things to move forward okay like but they were just not moving forward as quickly as you wanted it to okay you could be um rushing things all right but yeah things are just not moving at your speed on their on their emotions is the two of swords here. so this person needs to make a decision but they're absolutely indecisive right now okay they're choosing not to make a decision and uh, also someone who's blocking any kind of clarity okay this is someone who's blocking their heart chakra and someone who's just not ready to open up towards you even if you try to talk to this person here you're just going to be very very disappointed so disappointed so don't even try the mutual energy between both of you is the two of pentacles you're both trying to make up your mind about what you want to do this person more okay this person more you probably are quite decisive because you've ended things okay with the death here because it was just not moving forward you wanted quick movement here with the ten of wands here as your action this is a situation which is too much of a burden for you okay it's too much of work this relationship this connection it's becoming a burden to you okay so you're ready to release the situation and lay it off this person out here with the hierophant in reverse here looks like this is definitely someone who is commitment for okay this is someone who doesn't like to do things the traditional way and that could be one of the reasons here why you're ended things with this person okay high priestess in reverse as the outcome so either this is someone who's giving the silent treatment they're going to be ready to talk or this is someone who is just not being able to trust their intuition and their trust they're having a hard time differentiating between their ego and their intuition okay Let's see what okay, what's happening. Why the death? Why is the three of cups here? <coughs> Four of swords in reverse, the tower and the five of swords in reverse here. definitely someone who's coming in unexpectedly wanting a reconciliation okay this is definitely someone you walked away from someone who is playing who's just fucking with you okay or someone who's just playing a lot of mind games this is someone who's finally ready to talk to you okay coming out of isolation and trying to talk to you but with the tower here it's going to be very unexpected okay so yeah there is a potential of a reconciliation here with three of cups here and this is coming in if this hasn't it will definitely someone you've ended things with okay Someone who walked who you walked away from in the past because you felt very defeated. Someone who was constantly pushing you away, you know, due to fear because their guards were up and they constantly have a habit of sabotaging the connection between you both. Okay, so yeah, someone's ready to um, come out and talk, come out of their shell. This person could have healed or this person could have just withdrawn from you, but they're coming in, and you won't be expecting this. It's the death. What's the death? Why is this here? Yeah. <coughs> Queen of Swords in reverse, Eight of Pentacles in reverse, and the Chariot here. You stop putting in the work, okay? Because you were seeing no results. You put in your hundred percent, but there were just no results. You could have given this person an ultimatum over and over and over and over again, but this person was just someone who refused to listen to you, or it was just hitting a wall, you know. You couldn't get through your point, you know, to this person. And finally, you were fed up of them, and you cut them off. You cut them off from a place, a place of a lot of resentment, you know. You're very unforgiving, very bitter towards this person, okay. Because of course, I understand because you put in so much work, right? And with the chariot here, you're moving forward. And you're hell-bent on moving forward. Hell-bent on moving forward. 
you've cut them out in a way where you know you're like screw you i'm moving forward i don't want to be with you you know because you're very disappointed because you just didn't see the results of the kind of effort that you put in you know and you just cut this person off definitely being very cold and very unloving towards this person you know i understand <clears throat> Why is the Ace of Cups in reverse on this person's mind? The Empress, the Three of Cups in reverse, and the High Priestess in reverse. Could be a third party situation, okay? Maybe there was a third person here and now they're dropping that third person here, okay? Again, High Priestess in reverse here. This is someone who's ready to talk. This could be a third person here involved, okay, between you both. But I feel they're dropping the third party here. Because with the Empress here, they see you. They see your value. They see your self-worth. They see you as marriage material. They want commitment with you. Yeah. But they see you as someone very abundant. They see you as someone who doesn't give a shit to them, you know. You're okay on your own. <coughs> they see something long-term with you. Uh, you could be dealing with someone, you know, who, again, is someone who is not being able to trust that intuition also is what I'm getting here. But I feel more like this is someone who's ready to talk. Okay, on their mind, they definitely want to have a conversation. They may be emotionally shut off, okay, because they're sad, they're upset, they're depressed that you've gone away. They see that there are chances you won't want this reconciliation with them, okay. But, yeah. Um... Why is the two of pentacles here? <clears throat> the six of cups, the six of swords and the hermit. Definitely a lot of withdrawn energy, okay? One of you has pulled back, both of you have pulled back, okay? You're both doing a lot of soul searching, a lot of inner thinking, you know? You've gone within to find the answers, both of you. All. You're trying to take your own time, taking your space, not talking, no communication. But okay, with the six of cups here and six of swords, you both feel the strong soulmate connection and you both want to get out of this rocky waters and move towards a calmer place. But with the hermit here, you're both contemplating on what you want to do next, okay? Um... Tell me about the two of swords. Tell me about the two of swords. Whoa. So, yeah. Two of swords here. They have a lot of love for you. Page of cups. They want to communicate with you. Page of swords. They're watching you from a distance. But when it comes to talking and opening their mouth, they're suppressing the truth. There, there's a lot of resistance of communication from this person. They won't let the truth out because the truth is that they love you. They want you. They want a reconciliation with you. They want to apologize to you, okay? But they'll watch, look at you from a distance, spying, stalking, but everything at a distance. When it comes to talking to you and coming and clarifying the situation, they won't do it. They just won't do it. They'll hold back communication as much as they can. They are determined to hold back the communication, okay? Because I think they're doing a lot of thinking with the two of swords here. I feel for right now, they're trying to ignore the situation, okay? As much as they can. <clears throat> Tell me about um, the Hierophant in reverse. Why is the Hierophant in reverse? Wow, this person fears commitment big time, okay? They realize there's a fucking strong soulmate connection, okay? Twin flame soulmate connection. Wheel of Fortune, Justice and the Lovers in Reverse here. So this person definitely has a lot of love for you, okay? They do love you very, very much. They feel the strong soul tie connection to you, okay? They want to bring balance to the situation. Wheel of Fortune, they're wanting forward movement with you, okay? They want positive change. But they want a positive change. They want growth with you. But when it comes to labeling the connection, that's when they're not going to do it. Because this is someone who could be someone, you know, who's emotionally not available or someone who's emotionally not wanting to invest into this connection, you know. So I feel you were more emotionally involved in this connection than them, okay. And they're making a decision more like, um, a decision more in fear, you know. They're making a more a decision due to fear, you know. They're not making the right choice. They know what they need to do, but they're choosing not to, only because of fear of commitment, you know. 
they're not on the same page with you but they want to bring justice to this relationship here they're waiting for the right time probably but when it comes to committing that's when they're not going to do it okay so yeah the love is there but when it comes to labeling the connection doesn't look like they will um tell me why is the high priestess in reverse why is this the outcome why is the high priestess in reverse here why is this the outcome five of pentacles in reverse ace of wands in reverse oh la la ten of cups wow this person's finally gonna talk to you like i said this person's feeling very isolated they're feeling very left out by you in the cold okay they have this lack mentality they're trying to come out of it okay could be someone who has a lot of abandonment issues that's why the hierophant in reverse okay this person could be someone who's gone through a bad relationship in the past year they could have been very committed but someone screwed them over okay so this person definitely wants to return back to you they want to talk to you okay something's going to be revealed with the high priestess in reverse here they want the ten of cups here all right they want this happily ever after with you but the problem here is with the ace of wands in reverse here they're lacking the action so i do feel there is going to be communication between you guys okay but it's probably there are chances that it's going to be a false start okay because again this is not the kind of approach you're looking for okay they're coming back to you yes they are but <clears throat> it's it's the same cycle here okay it's like ace of wands in reverse is a situation which is going nowhere right but this is again lack of action like the passion is there but they're not taking action towards this so i feel when they're going to come back to you you're going to be the one who is not going to give any pay any heed to them okay that's why this could be a missed opportunity in a new beginning because they definitely have this reunion on their mind that's the current situation so they are coming to you you okay but with the likely outcome here <clears throat> again when it comes to that new beginning here i feel it's going to be a false start again because they're not coming to you in the right approach okay again they're coming into you towards you with that non committal attitude but yes they love you a lot and they want this happily ever after with you but when it comes to putting in that label of getting exclusive or getting married etc that's what they're running from okay they're commitment phobic so that's something you need to take care of okay that's what i have for you cancer i hope this reading resonates with you leave your comments below like share subscribe and i will see you next time